for you as a human being, there's nothing like that fulfillment. There's nothing like that special touch on your soul. William at this point is still strong. In fact, this is the strongest he's ever been. And I feel his strength. And I know he can do so much more. We're gonna go to the green line. William is gonna walk to the nurse's station. Right there. Right there. Yeah. Like him too. You can't do that. Right. He's a, he's a drifter driver, he steers yeah. to the left. Yeah. <laughs> we got a couple more feet. Right there. Right there. Left. Right. Left. Right. This is what I say. I say once we get up there, we walk to that green line. See the green line? Oh. Not that far. We walk to the green line. Sound good? Okay. Then we go wave to the nurses. Ready? Right? Right? Left. William's flow is perfect, and his angels are right beside him. William just walked the whole length of the hallway without sitting down once. He had no pain, no discomfort. And he did it. William was so proud of himself that he even took his hands off the walker and started to clap. This was the biggest record for William. And in essence, he just completed a marathon. After, you know, over a month with him, no medicine, and you see him walk the whole length of the hallway, what are your thoughts? Well, prior to that, just the fact that he was so 
uh, hurt with the holes in his body, his back. Um, he was uh, in morphine for the pain care of it, and his leg, uh, with all the breakouts and the uh, oozing of uh, serum and so forth, and then to take that walk from his room to the desk. Uh, normally, this is like a 25 mile hike for somebody that was amazing and spirited. And uh, he applauded himself when he finished beside everybody uh, giving him the momentum. The very next day, William said that he's folding his hand. He told me now that he is ready for heaven. He said that he accomplished more than he could ever imagine and that he's going out ahead of the game. He said it was almost like winning a Super Bowl and then retiring. And I was so happy for William and how can I fight him wanting to go to heaven? Heaven's the best place. William wasn't afraid to go to heaven. He was actually looking forward to it. He wanted to see all the family and friends that previously went to heaven. And now he could finally touch them and hug them and dance on the clouds with them. In three weeks, William willed himself to heaven. But he waited for his nephew Bob to come and say goodbye. And this rainbow appeared the very same day.